Hello, friends. It is time for our reading group. This week, our book is called The Mitten. On the cover, I see the title of the book. I see a... That's right. I see a mitten. I see some trees. And I see white stuff on the ground. That's called snow. That's right. The snow on the ground and the trees with no leaves tell me it's what season? Is it spring or winter? That's right. The snow on the ground tells me it's winter. Winter is also when I would wear mittens. Before we get started, we're going to answer a few questions. The first one says, I wear mittens in the I wear mittens in the winter, in the spring, or in the summer. I can use my finger and move the red circle to tell me that I wear mittens in the winter. Our next question says, mittens go on my, hmm, mittens go on my hands, mittens go on my feet, or mittens go on my head. I'm going to use my pointer finger and move the circle to tell me that mittens go on my hands. Very good. Let's go over our vocabulary words. We have lots of vocabulary words this week. First, we have our core word. Our core word this week is the word put. We have a vocabulary word, bear. This boy is cold. That fire is warm. I see a mitten. I see just one mitten in this picture. What's this animal? That's right, it's a rabbit. I see another animal. This one is a, that's right, it's a bird. It's a blue jay. One more animal. This is a very small animal. It's an ant. Very good. Now we have three describing words of things that these animals are going to do in the story. The first one is squish. You can squish your hands together. Squish. The next word is squash. Squash your hands together. In this picture, they're squashing. It looks like Play-Doh. And our last word is squeeze. They are squeezing a towel. All right, friends, it is time to start reading our book. Are you ready? Here we go. I see the title, The Mitten. Hmm, that looks like a very big mitten. What do you see? That's right, I see a bear and a mitten and snow and trees. Let's get our pointer finger out. Here we go. The bear was cold. The bear got into the warm mitten. Whoa, I see lots of our vocabulary words. Ready? I see the word bear. I see the picture of the bear, and then I see the word bear one, two times. I see our vocabulary word mitten. This tells us that the bear got into the mitten. There's the mitten. I see our vocabulary word warm. It tells us that the mitten was warm. One more on this page. I see the vocabulary word cold. The words tell me that the bear was cold. All right, friends, we have something special today. Miss Claire has a mitten that looks just like this mitten. We are going to use our core word put. And what should I put into my mitten? You're right. I should 
put the bear in the mitten. Here we go. In he goes. Turn the page. The fox was cold too. He got into the mitten with the bear. Look, we find out that the fox was cold. Since he was cold, he decided to get into the mitten. That's right. Now we see our fun words. Squish, squash, squeeze. Look, that mitten looks like it's moving around and shaking as they get in the mitten. Turn the page. Now we're on page number six. The rabbit was cold. She got into the warm mitten too. We see a new animal. This animal is the rabbit. We see the word rabbit and we see a picture of the rabbit. We know that the rabbit was cold. She was cold. So she got into the warm mitten. All right. I see the rabbit. We are going to put the rabbit into Miss Claire's mitten. Do you think there's room? Here we go. Put the rabbit in. Squish, squash, squeeze. Ah. Squish, squash, squeeze. Ah. Look, they have to make room in the mitten. Let's turn the page to page number eight. The blue jay was cold too. He got into the mitten after rabbit. Hmm, what vocabulary words do I see? I see blue jay. I see a picture of the blue jay and I see the words blue jay. I also see that the blue jay was cold. Brr. The blue jay wanted to get into the mitten. That's right. We see a big mitten now. All right, friends, it's time to use our core word put. We need to put the, that's right, we're going to put the blue jay into the mitten. Here we go. Open the mitten. Put the blue jay in. In the blue jay goes. Now we can see that it says squish, squash, squeeze. Ah, look, the mitten is bigger than it was before because the blue jay got in the mitten. Let's turn the page. Page number 10. Page 10 tells us the ant was cold. The ant got into the mitten. We see the ant. That's right. He is a small ant. We see a picture of the ant and we see the word ant two times. We know that the ant was feeling cold. We see the word cold. So the ant decided to get into the mitten. We see a picture of the mitten and we see the word mitten. Okay, time to use our core word. We're going to put the ant into the mitten. Here we go. Open up our mitten, put the ant inside, and the ant goes. Squish, squash, squeeze. What do you see here? I see feathers poking out. I see a nose poking out. What do you think is going to happen? Let's turn the page and find out. Kaboom! Oh no, 
the mitten broke. The animals were too big and they caused the mitten to break apart. That was a fun story. All right, friends, now it's your turn to go through the mitten all by yourself. 